Hello, my friends. Welcome. My name is Carter Kane. This is episode number five of our Fay Farm Let's Play. How are you doing today? I hope you're doing well. Uh, what is this? Uh, take care of your health from Vera. My apprentice and I have noticed you're preparing to explore the mine. Yes. Yes, I have been. Have you considered the benefits of carrying potions with you? No, I have not. They're light, convenient, and very useful should you encounter anything dangerous. Come visit our shop and learn about our selection of potions. They're next best thing to having to having a healer in your pocket. Stay well. Okay, Vera, we're going to come and see you today then because uh, that sounds amazing. Uh, where are you at? You're not in the plains. Are you in the west town? Are you at the docks? No. East town? You're in East Town. Okay. Cool. Well, we need to go back to Eddie. Who is the fisherman, right? I think so. Uh, <laughs> uh, it's been a second since I've... Uh, uh, literally a second since I've played the game. Um, for you guys, it's a whole day. For me, it's literally like a five-minute break. Uh <laughs> Because sometimes I get on a roll with recording and all I want to do is play the game and record. And that's that's basically what's happening with this game. Uh, it, Yeah, it's it's a lot. I am going to spend so much time in this game. Um, Eddie's down here. He's down here. I gotta go over here and I gotta go up here. And he's right there. Hey, bud. Uh, redeem quest. Smell the fish from here. You've done well. I'm telling you, you'll turn into a mariner yet. The town will eat well tonight. Yes, they will. I should probably introduce you to my sisters. They own a ranch in the plains of plenty. Take care of farm animals. <gasps> farm animals! Yes. Cool. Cool. Erlene's. Her name is Erlene. <laughs> Eddie and Erlene. Okay. Uh, the cluck and doe. That's cute. Erlene and Loretta. <laughs> My accent's going to come out way too bad in this episode. <laughs> Erlene and Loretta. Okay. Uh, I have been carrying the family business selling and breeding chickoos and cottontails. I bet you those are chickens and rabbits. Erlene and Lurlene. Aspen wants to talk to me. We're going to go to the pastures, though, my friends, because I have got to see Erlene and Loretta. Uh... <laughs> Oh, that is amazing. How do I, I'm guessing they're up here somewhere. Um, yeah, something like that. You're not who I need. You're probably over here. Yes. Erlene, how you doing, Erlene? You counting your eggs this morning? You look like you're drooling, but that's a bit of hay. That is so country. Uh, <laughs> Redeem quest. What can your pal Erlene do for you, stranger? Your name is Carter Kane. Eddie sent you? Well, he must have gotten down off his high sea horse if he sent you to us. Listen, I, I love a good family drama. Now my sister and I can tell you everything about raising happy and healthy animals on your farm. Thank you. I've been holding the key to that coop near your farm since so I'm using it here. You can have it. Wait, I've had a farm and a coop on my farm and you've had got the key? I don't like that. What, who else has keys to my stuff? I'm I'm concerned. I'm concerned for my safety. Uh, <laughs> your coop can house the roundest of fluff balls, the cottontail, and my personal favorite, the chiku. After you purchase an animal, you need to register it to your coop ledger. This is important. If an animal isn't registered, it won't know where home is. Okay. Some bookkeeping. You can also use the ledger to rename them only if you want. Loretta names her animals, and I think she does a pretty good job. Now, this is a big step. This is another living creature that is now under your care. You need to let them out, feed them, give them attention, and love them. Okay. Uh, so, are you up for the challenge? If you are, you can buy one of my pet chickens and then register it at your coop ledger. Uh, I'm going to have to do that either way because that's what the quest tells me to do. Yeah. <laughs> uh, buy and sell. Um, buy an animal. I would like to buy a chiku. Purchase. Okay, your name is Lucky. Um, are you gonna follow me? You're gonna follow me. Interesting. I have to go all the way to my home. Ber berries. 
I have berries. I have to get the berries. I cannot walk past the berries without getting the berries. I, I need the berries. Okay. Okay. You're... I'm trapped. The chicken trapped me and I couldn't move. I don't know how I feel about that. Um... I've never been trapped by my dinner before. Um... Sounds like a bit of, uh, uh, a bit of something you would see on, like, my 600 pound life. Can I catch this bee? I would really like a bee. Yes. Okay. All right. We're going to go to my farmstead and find this magical... Where, did my chicken get lost? Okay. Uh, we're going to find this magical coop that somebody has been keeping. Oh, it's right here. Oh, I see. I see. Oh, okay. Can I, can I pet you? I can pet you. Where did you go? Um, you're in the coop. How do I feed them? What do I feed them with? How how do I feed them? Lurleen. Or Erling did not tell me how to feed them. I'm going to combine their names into one every single time. Uh, Erling did not can tell me how to feed these things. I don't know what I'm doing. No idea what I'm doing. Maybe she'll tell me now. Uh, rude. Uh, investigate that. Wooden cross fence. I'll take it. I don't know what that is. Uh, but I'll take Rude. Uh, no. Get out of the field. You rudeness. <laughs> hey, fence. Cool. Got it. More of you? Really? Uh, nope. Hey, bundle. Interesting. Any down here? What are these? I just noticed these. What are these? Are they like cow sheeps? Are they cheeps? Oh my gosh. If they name these things cheeps, I can't even with that. Um, who are you? Patel. Competitive farmer. Animal breeding services. For your mamu or woolly horn? Uh, I don't need any of that. Who are you? Jeremiah. Mm, 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 mm. Buy and sell? They're woolly horns. Oh. Well, that'd be alright. Not quite the cheaps that I was hoping for. Uh, what is with these things trying to get in my way all of a sudden? We were fine. We were having a good day, and now I'm completely distracted because I see more berries that I have to pick up, and I keep getting accosted by these purple thorny things coming out of the ground like my one of my worst nightmares. I don't know what's happening here. I, I, I don't know what's happening here. There is something going on. As more berries. I'm going to fill my inventory with berries. All right, there's more right here. I can sneak in and grab them. Can I get those two? Yeah, but they're falling into the, the mess over there. Oh. Oh, no. No, 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 no. That's not where I need to be. They told me not to go in there. Why am I going in there? I don't know. Where am I going? I need to find these people and go back to Erlene and tell her that I registered my chicken and I don't know where she is. There she is. Found her. Listen, this is just rude. Where do you keep coming from? Nope. Nope. You leave the chickens alone. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. You leave the chickens alone. They did nothing to you. What is that? That's creepy. Uh, redeem quest. Not a satisfied customer. I bet your new chicken was over the moon to be living with you. I 
highly doubt that. I want chicken nuggets. Now, don't you forget to give it lots of love and attention. Maybe you can walk it down past Eddie and ask him where's the last time he walked a fish. You two hate each other, and I love it. Uh, now that you've got your little chiku, it's time to hand you over to my sister. She's excited to meet you and talk your ear off. Okay. Learn about feeding animals. See, I was wondering. Okay, she's going to tell me. Redeem quest. It should only take a couple minutes. I hope you're not busy. Uh, now, what to feed them? You see, if you let your animals outside, there's grazing land around. They'll be able to nibble their heart's content. There isn't enough grass to graze on. Just plant some. But even in Azoria, not every day is a good day for animals. Some will go indoors if it's raining or snowing. Can you blame them? No, I cannot. I also go indoors when it's raining or snowing or sunny or nighttime. Anyway, uh, <laughs> on days like that, you'll want to feed your animals with fodder. Put the fodder in their trowel and your animals will eat it. Or trough, depending on who you talk to. Different animals like different kinds of fodder, so try cutting all sorts of weeds and grass. Why don't you go ahead and cut some weeds to get plant fiber then load it into the trough in your coop? Oh. Oh. You have a quest? Um, learn to speak Chiku. I can't say I ever thought to try. More than a friendly wave to call any animal near, large or small. Your wave emote is just the thing you need whenever you're in the area of your farm animals. Try using that emote to call them to you. Uh, sure. Uh, that's the spirit. Wave your emote near any of your registered farm animals. Okay. Well, uh, listen, here's the thing. I don't know how to open the emote menu. I did earlier at some point. By complete accident, and I have no clue how to do it. So we're going to find that out in a minute, probably, most likely. But right now, i got to go feed my chickens, because I don't want my chickens to not have food. What is this? Is this something I can... No. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Over here picking everything up, trying to pick everything up. Not picking anything up. All right. I need... Look at all the berries. Look at all the berries. Do you see that? Listen, we're going to make so much money off of those berries. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and throw you in there and have you cook them all. That was the wrong button completely. All right. I need plant fiber out of my storage. That is what I came over here for, and I didn't even grab it because that was dumb. Doop -a -doo. Okay, we're going to go in here into our coop. Our barn or whatever this is the trough I'm gonna throw in some plant fibers add feed oh maximum feed reach oh I, I do one per oh okay that's cool you got food you need to go outside ma'am would you like to come outside the door is open. You went in there on your own. I don't know how to get you back outside. I just don't. All right. We're going to go back to Loretta. Maybe I can remember how to get over there now since I've been over there twice. The answer is no. Probably not. <laughs> uh, I did it again, didn't I? Yep. I went the wrong way. She's up here. Mm-hmm. Nope. 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 That was wrong. Up here? Nope. I am so bad with directions. So very bad with directions. Maybe she's down? Nope, she's over here. I figured it out. I know you're proud of me. It's okay. Uh, <laughs> Redeem quest. Happy little chickos. Such a quick learner. I can already tell that you're going to make a fantastic rancher. I'm glad Eddie sent you our way. Things have been a little cold between us since he quit the family business for the sea. Listen, uh, I, I understand, but I don't need your family drama. Eddie's always been a bit of a contrarian, but he has a good heart and will always put others first. Except when it comes to his sisters. Uh, you should probably go back and tell him about your new Chiku and tell him his sisters love him. Oh, he's going to hate that. He's going to hate it, but I'll go back over there. 
Sure. I mean, he might not hate it. I don't know. I don't know this man. Um. Okay. I wish we could run in this game. But there's no way to run. That I know of, anyway. If you know a way, please tell me. I want to be able to run. Do, 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 do. Redeem quest. <laughs> Hello there. Have you been exploring it? Island's got a lot of secrets ready for the finding. Quest. I learned that an important bit about the sinking of my poor Grace. A whirlpool that took her was a magical whirlpool. Listen, I probably guessed that already. Uh, though really, that should be of little surprise to anyone on this island. We seem to attract the strangest magical phenomena. Uh, yeah. No one is really sure about when the whirlpool started, but I've been tracking them and I've noticed that they all start out at the beach with the entrance to the old saltwater mines. We're unlocking mining. We're unlocking mining. This is my favorite part of the day. I bet my last sand dollar that whatever is causing the whirlpools is shut away in that mine. I'd go check it out myself, but the mines are locked ever since Cleo managed to wrangle all the jumbles in there. Oh, jumbles are the objects that got animated by the wild magic. One day my steering wheel just rolled off and attacked me. What? It was wild, but we managed to get them all into the mines. So, you took all of the things that are angry, and you locked them underground? I'm, I'm just making sure I'm on the same page here, because it seems to me like you kidnapped them, and now you're holding them captive. Of course they're going to be mad at you. I saw what you did with that magical staff of yours. Maybe, just maybe, you can handle some jumbles as well. You'll need to if you're going to find the source of the whirlpools. You're going to need the key to the saltwater mines first, though, so go and find Cleo and tell her Eddie sent you. I am all for this. Where is Cleo? You are at somewhere? Frida Beach. You're at the beach. Okay, we're going to go east. We have to go east. To the right, to the right. All of the mines to the right. I don't know that word. Or that song or anything like that. I don't know these things. You have a thought bubble. What are you, what are you thinking, ma'am? Uh, yeah, chat. Could Azoria have a king or queen? Maybe. The Marquis certainly believe he's a royalty. I'm sure he does. Or the Marquis. I don't know how to say that word. I probably should look it up. Because to me, it reminds me of the, the Maki from Star Trek. And that's probably not right either. Um, redeem quest. Please tell me we can go into the mine. Can we go into the mine? Can we go into the mine? Don't be modest, Carter Cat. I know you've got a passion for exploring the unknown. You've braved an ocean journey, for goodness sake. I didn't have a choice. I hit a whirlpool. Uh, <laughs> I'm Cleo, a story of premier adventurer. You were the talk of the town at the Coast Critter Inn last night. People are talking about me at the inn. I don't like that. I have a reputation. I wonder what they're saying. I hope it's good. Uh, what can I do for you? Eddie sent you to get the key to the mines? Oh, wow. I don't know if I can trust you with the key. Sorry. Not that I can't trust you to use it. We locked the mines for a reason. I can't let anyone in there. It's full of jumbles. Oh. It's true that you've been doing a bang-up job getting rid of the thorns. Tell you what. If you can show me that you're capable of taking care of yourself down there, I'll give you the key. Okay. Best way to show me your preparedness is to buy yourself a healing potion and cook some food to keep your energy up. Okay, I guess I'm going over to Vera, who is over here, I think. No, you're in... Did I say you are in East Town? Yeah, you're in East Town. Okay. Guess we're going to Vera. We're not to the mines yet. How rude. Thought I was making progress here, but... Are you here? You are here. Cool. Do, 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 do. You're who? Ginger? Um, that's a very strange name. Nah, whatever. Uh, scroll. Emerald Tile Drug. Cool. Uh, Vera. Hello, Vera. Chet. Before you arrived, it had been a long time since we had a new face, I'm sure. 
Okay, I need a healing potion. Um, this one. I need one. Because I think that solves the quest. Does that deal? Is that what I need for the quest? I can't see. Yes. I need some food for the mines. Some food for the mines. Luckily, I told my uh, homestead to cook all of those berries before I left. So guess what? That is a fancy frog that I missed. I'm going to get that frog. Can I pet that frog? Can I pet that frog? I did not get that frog. Why am I not catching this frog? Is it too fancy for me? Oh, this frog is annoying. Can I bet that frog? Got it! <laughs> I win. Okay. <laughs> I'm going up here to my homestead to get some food. Some food from the mine or for the mines. Got it. Uh, look at my inventory though. That is atrocious. All right. Gotta go to Cleo. Gonna go back down to Cleo. I don't need that frog. I got a fancy one. Uh, what is the? Oh, that's the flower lady. I was told there's a scroll right there, and I'm gonna get it. Yep. <laughs> told you I was going to get it. Did you doubt me? How dare you? Uh, <laughs> Redeem quest. Redeemed. Uh, potions, food. Yep, you're all equipped. I think you can handle it from here. This key to the saltwater mines is yours. Ooh, before you go running off, though, I've got another thing or two to teach you about exploring dangerous dungeons. Why did you not tell me this before? There, are, There's more? Okay. So a dungeon is what we adventurers call any large and potentially risky place you might want to venture through. You can leave a dungeon anytime you like, but when you return, you'll have to work your way through all the levels you already explored, unless you make some dungeon seals as you go. I'll teach you how if you've got a minute. You're not busy with anything, right? Nope, this is exactly what I wanted. Uh, so a dungeon seal is a bit of mechanical magic that lets you revisit a specific floor of a dungeon directly, without having to explore the floors above first. A little magic, a little crafting ingenuity, and you have yourself a bona fide shortcut. All you need is a copper to make one, and guess where that is? In the dungeon! Uh, you know, that's very convenient. Keep in mind that you have to place dungeon seals in order. Place one on the first level down, then on the second one, and so on. So why don't you try making a dungeon seal? You'll craft that in a seal crafting station. If you don't already have one, you can probably construct one pretty easily. I don't have a... Crafting station... I gotta go find some copper ore. I guess they're in the mine. So guess where I'm going. To the mine. I think it's down here. Yep. I'm in the mine. I'm in the mine. I'm so excited. I love mining in games. Ooh. Ooh. There's stuff and things in here. There's stuff and things. Stuff and things in here. What are you? Can I mine you? You are... Not copper, probably. Um... Coal. That's probably very important for me. Probably. Look at all the new recipes. We're gonna hide that hint. Uncover the switch to unlock the door. Place a dungeon seal. Okay. Uh, I'm looking for copper. Can I find any copper in here? This all looks to be... Or is it in these rocks that I... No. Is there no copper on floor one? That's rude. I have to uncover the seal. Where's the seal? Hmm... 
Well, let's mine up some coal. Because the hint up there says, uncover the switch to unlock the door. Okay, well. Guess I have to find it. Gonna do some mining. Maybe? If it will let me? Do I see anything strange that might be the seal? Or the... Whatchamacallit? I think my bag is... No, we're good. We're good. I was worried that my bag was full, but my bag is not full. No. Let's keep going. The good news is, we have unlocked the mines. And this is what I've been most excited about for like three days now. So. <gasps> Found it. Floor two. We need copper. There needs to be copper somewhere in this thing. I need copper. I don't see any copper. Do I see any copper up here? Nope. These mines are crazy. Alright. Well, let's go find the thing. I wonder if it's in here somewhere. One thing I don't know is if these mines reset. Like, if I take all the stuff out of it now, will they, like, reset? Can I come back and farm them for, for more? I hope I can. Because if I can, I'm going to spend a day mining. It's almost bedtime. We're going to get sent back to our house. That's okay. That is a-okay. <gasps> Got it. Maybe we can get up there. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Go, 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 go. Please have copper. Please? Uh, no. Copper. Two? Rude. Is there any more? Do I see any more? Or is that it? Please tell me that's not it. I think that's it. That's rude. Oh well. See, but then the mines have to reset then. Because if I can't get copper enough to open that door the first time I come in here. It'll have to reset, right? Well, we're going to find out. When we go back to our house, though, I'm going to see if we can't make one of those crafting stations. Um, the seal crafting station? Oh, I'm gonna get kicked out of here. Yep. Okay. Well, my friends, that ends it for today. Uh, we will start episode number six with trying to see if we can craft one of those benches. I hope that we can. Maybe we can't, but we're gonna find out. And then we will continue our journey into the mines to see what kind of trouble we get and get into. So until next time, my friends, thank you so much for hanging out with me. I hope you've enjoyed this. Please let me know in the comments how you're enjoying Fay Farm. Are you playing the game? Do you enjoy it? I, so far, I think I'm completely addicted to this game. Uh, hey, whatever. There are worse things. <laughs> well, thank you so much. Have a good one.